We haven't always had LGBT communities. In fact, the label of homosexual to indicate a social and sexual identity was not invented by sexologists until the late 1800s. It's true that there have always been people in America and elsewhere who had sexual or romantic relationships with people who were their same sex, but they did not identify as homosexual or lesbian or gay or bisexual. Indeed, in America we did not gather and form LGBT communities or our own unique cultures until the dawn of the 20th century. This course will introduce you to the history of lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender cultures and communities in America. We'll start by exploring the effect of the Industrial Revolution on the development of urban homosexual communities when thousands of people migrated from their rural homes to America's expanding urban centers. We'll talk about how the wars of the 20th century, especially the two world wars, carved out space in big cities for gay and lesbian communities to flourish, even as lesbians and gays were persecuted by local, state, and federal authorities. We'll learn how harassment by psychiatrists, police, courts, schools, families, and other social institutions actually pushed LGBT people into an underground solidarity with each other. We'll discuss how gay and lesbian people created their own families, their own networks of affiliation through urban bars, separatist spaces, urban neighborhoods, support groups, churches, and formal organizations to stake out physical, psychological, and social spaces of belonging. We'll read about rural lesbians and gays, how they have farmed and ranched, raised livestock, families, and sometimes hell. We'll study how, in the 1970s, bisexuals raised their voices, demanding and achieving visibility in the gay and lesbian movement. And we'll talk about the shifts in transgender identity, studying drag queens and kings, transsexuals, and other gender outlaws. The class will explore how LGBT communities shifted from being invisible in the late 1800s to being pathologized and hypervisible throughout much of the 20th century. From seeking liberation in the 1970s to seeking civil rights in the 1990s. From dealing with the horror and the stigma of the AIDS epidemic in the late 1980s through the 1990s to being assimilated into mainstream American life through the legalization of same-sex marriage in the past few years. And how, throughout all the changes in America during the last 150 years, LGBT people have found each other. The course is a hybrid course, meaning that you can participate in class activities either face-to-face -face on campus in Fairbanks or any place where you have a webcam, microphone, and good internet access. The course will count towards your history major or minor, offers upper division credit, and counts as a social science course for your core requirements. Take the class for credit or take the class for fun. Everyone is welcome.